afternoon. We have just not stopped this morning. Um, got lots of bits and bobs done, been shopping in town. And I made um, Alfie and Deb, Alfie naughty. What did she do? He just put the flower on the on herself. Oh no. Just... She made a flower angel, hasn't she? Yeah. Oh my days. We can't touch our belly. No, can't touch her because what happens? What? If we touch her, what happens? Um, her magic goes, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Um, but yeah, she's been to nursery. <laughs> I have done a few jobs this morning as well. And we're finally home. Just emptying the bag from Marks and Spencers. Um, we got a gift card, so I've got a few bits and bobs to put away for Christmas. It's not long now, is it? Um, little, little one has two official days at nursery and a party. Little has four official days at school, and then it's over until next year. So I'm gonna get on, put all this stuff away, um, and speak to you in a bit. So we've been for a few now, and I finally sat down. I wanted to quickly show you the milkshake I picked up. So Marks and Spencers are doing this gingerbread milkshake. And I must admit, I think this is delicious. <laughs> it's very, very nice. I was a little bit worried because I had seen a few reviews saying they didn't like it. But to me, it tastes like a gingerbread in a milk. <coughs> so it's very, very good. I also went to Greg's for lunch and I picked myself up a Christmas cake slice because why not? Um, love a bit of Christmas cake and it was there. So I thought I'd grab it. You got yourself a snack? Yeah, Bear. You got a Barney Bear? <coughs> oh my days. Did you have a good day at nursery? Yeah. Awesome. What did you get up to? I got to play to the garden. Huh? I think I said the You played in the garden? Yeah, the cars and, and the bike second. Wow. Alright. Don't don't talk when don't talk with your mouth open, darling. Because you're eating, okay? Mm. With your mouth full, that's it. Um, mm. But yeah, we're going to go and get Lil soon from school. It's not that far off. Mm -hmm. And I've got a couple more jobs to do. I've got to stop at one more shop to go and get some pizzas. Because the pizzas at Marks and Spencers didn't look all that today. So we decided not to. Um, I also need to get some chocolate for Liam. Um... So that is our plan. I'm also going to drop a bag of clothes oh. off to a old school friend for her daughter from this one. Um, so that is my plan. Just getting other stuff done and trying to get this house clear before Christmas. I am slowly getting there. Slowly but surely. I have a list and I'm slowly getting through the list. So fingers crossed before the end of next week it will be done. <laughs> So, we've not long been home from the school run. I just wanted to quickly show you what I got from Marks and Spencers. I've got some cream crackers for Christmas. These are obviously perfect to have like crackers and cheese. I do already have my cheese in. I always have Wensleydale with apricots for Christmas. I've got some dark chocolate Jaffa cakes. Liam loves these. Bottle of juices because we need it. Then I've got these for Christmas sort of picky meals. We've got some onions, like pickled onions and pickled cocktail cornicons cornichons but i call them gherkins completely forgot what to call them then we have a bag of chocolate coins this which is for uh, liam's mum because we've already got one but these are the shortbread light up houses absolutely stunning love these we picked up these because we love these chickens so liam's got the flying the fiery flaming chicken tenders i have we've both got the classic chicken steaks as well and the southern fried chicken tenders as well these are three for 12 pound then lastly we have a box of chocolates for christmas too and that was our little m s haul so we've been home for a little while i have just showed you what we got from marks and spencers when we were down there we did have a gift card and we still have more to spend on it but it was so busy in there that we just couldn't get our heads around what we kind of needed um so if i go down again i'll show you the rest of it but we have been getting odds and sods for christmas so for so long that i think we're pretty much shorted now um someone messaged not messaged someone commented saying when you go do a christmas haul i'm not sure whether i'm going to do another big christmas a, a big food shop before or after christmas now um so if i do i will film it for you um 
but if I don't, you'll have maybe little snippets like you did today with the Marks and Spencers one. Oh, that went down wrong. <laughs> I have also been to Morrison's just to get a couple of pizzas and a present for a party that Lil's has been invited to. Um, but yeah, we are home. It is dark, very dark. I need to put the Christmas lights on in here. It was dark by four o'clock today, which was crazy. Uh, we left Morrison's and it was so dark, but hey um that's winter for you isn't it that's why i love the run up to christmas <coughs> i love the run up to christmas and all that sort of run up to new year but then for the first couple of months of like the next year i find i, I struggle I'm not gonna lie with the, with the dark evenings um with my anxiety a little bit I'm hoping I can keep it under control this year like I have for the past few years. Liam is an absolute saviour. Uh, when I very first had my panic, my first panic attack, he was straight on Google, finding ways to cope um, and things to do and things not to do. Um, so he is incredible. I really don't know what I'd do without him sometimes. I've got my TA course tomorrow, so I need to quickly have a look over some work that I need to get done. I actually need to do my poster tonight. I did a poster. And then it got away in my bag. So I need to redo that and then submit that tomorrow. And that'll be book three in and submitted. So, yeah. And then she's got a Christmas performance tomorrow. Quite busy with my dad tomorrow. I'm just trying to fit everything in this week. It's ridiculous. I've got a couple of things to take over to my friend on Thursday. It's never ending. Um, but hopefully once this is all done, we have a nice tidy clear flat and a nice fresh place to be um before the madness of christmas but anyway i'm gonna go enjoy the coffee that liam made me and i shall speak to you in a bit so i am currently getting ready for bed i think we and liam are going early night because it's not even 10 o'clock and we're both like ready for bed i think um so it's been another pretty normal day just getting mum life done really i haven't filmed a lot again but Hope you enjoyed what I have filmed. Um, my last video got a lovely load of comments, so thank you so so much. Tomorrow is my TA course, which starts at ten. So hopefully we've got to drop the van off before school run, then I'm going to pick Liam up, go do school run, come back here, pack my bag. It's going to be a manic day tomorrow, but hey. Um, but yeah. Pizza was nice. Crispy, crispy potatoes. We've been loving those at the moment. Um, they were from Morrison's. They were really nice. Kitchen is pretty organised. The house is pretty clean, to be perfectly honest. I hoovered earlier, tidy bits and bobs away, and hopefully it will stay organised. Oh, you can see what I mean. I'm tired. Um, just about to light my advent candle. And we and we, me and Liam are watching um, The Big Bang Theory. I think we're on season three of that at the moment. Gone back to that for like the fourth time. It's one of those comfort shows, a bit like Friends, that we go back to. But anyway, I'm going to sign off for tonight. I am going to settle down and I shall see you tomorrow for another vlogmas. Bye.